are here. Good morning. How are you guys? You're still in your pajamas. Great. Hello, Mimo. Hello, Addie. Hello, Walker. I got this. Guess what, guys? Look what I have. caramelizing some apples and some butter for this great pancake recipe. Perfect pancakes by Sweet Enough. Yeah, so you cook them until they're sort of brown and soft. It doesn't sound like good. <laughs> well, I like, you know what I think is cool about these is what? that they go, the apples go the in the pancakes rather than on top of the pancakes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The lemon, lemony cream cheese pancakes with blueberries by E. Nunn going. And so in a mixer we have buttermilk and Egg yolks, and we're gonna beat these. And Meryl is getting. I'm gonna chop up your cream cheese. Yeah. I just love the pockets that this these little chunks of cream cheese create in the pancakes. You'll see they're sort of oozy little melty cheese pockets. <laughs> I just like that this, is, this one is sort of like 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 New York bagel meets pancake. Oh, you like that? Yeah. I do like that. <laughs> Very nice. Very nice. It should seem like uh, cottage cheese. Yeah, large, large curds. And I'm going to add vanilla. And Meryl's going to add lemon zest and some melted butter. Yum. And lemon juice. Yeah. And then we just whip that up. Meryl flipping egg white. I actually kind of like doing this. So I'm rolling dry ingredients into the wet. I'm going to so turn this. This is how you off. fold. You cut through the middle and use your other hand to turn the bowl. Oh, very nice. And it actually looks quite um, lumpy. You want them stiff but not dry. Pancakes really is a two-man job. Oh yeah, totally. They're rough. I don't know how any. Listen, we've oops. had very little caffeine. <laughs> yes. Okay, just leave it like that. And we'll we're do the other go. one. Yeah, fantastic. So now we're starting the perfect pancakes, which have the caramelized apples in them. Eggs. Milk. Do you want to grab the vanilla? Sure. Does that go right now? Yep. So this is um, the coolest part of this recipe, in my opinion. You whip the liquid until it gets really frothy. It almost looks like ice cream soda. Yeah. So it's nice and frothy. Now it's time to add the dry ingredients. So I'm just gently going to mix them in. I'm just going to finish this with a spatula. You don't want to over whisk. Now I'm going to add melted butter and the apples. These are really, really delicious and don't require a whole lot more effort than plain pancakes. I mean, these apples take five minutes and they add this great flavor and texture. So the batters are both finished and we're going to cook them up in a few minutes and have some pancakes. So we decided to go with nonstick pans. So actually, my pan's pretty hot. I think I might lower the heat a little. Lots of butter. It always helps. Woo! It's jumping around. So the goal here is for each of us to make two perfect pancakes. Oh, look how fluffy these are. Yeah, they're how very cool. Very I'm going to add a little bit more to this one over here. And if you're looking for the moment to flip your pancake, you actually, a lot of people will say, wait for bubbles on top, but that doesn't always work. What you want to do is watch for it to, be, to look dry around the edges, around the base, because that means that it started to cook, you know, almost halfway up, and then you flip it over and the rest of it will cook. And it always cooks much more quickly on the other side. Exactly. Oh! oh whoa. Whoa. <laughs> this work, Meryl. We're all here for you. <laughs> I think the spatula's It takes narrow. a village. No, it does. It's the spatula's fault. It's the spatula's fault, <laughs> yes. I think mine might be finished. I'm going to put one. Oh. Such beauty. Ta-da! Such loveliness. <laughs> oh, here we go. Oh, lovely. Oh. Those look pretty good. You flip them. You'll you'll watch. You'll see the pancake will actually rise, and when it's sort of fully puffed, kind of like you know uh, a rooster with its feathers. You um, nice you like metaphor. To, uh, do you like that? <laughs> um, <laughs> now the caffeine's talking. Um, 
<laughs> uh, that that you know that that the pancake. I mean, in, in addition to it being brown on its other side, oh, it, that's, that's another sign that it's finished. Okay. This time, mm. <clears throat> and this is grade B, which a lot of people favor over grade A. I like it a lot. It's mm. A little more earthy. So. Looks like you cooked this perfectly. Mmm. Mm. Ooh. <laughs> Just got a little pocket of cream cheese with the maple syrup. Oh, me too. Yeah. All right, it's up to you guys. Yum. <laughs>